How obedient would you say you are? To you? Mm -hmm. I would attend would be the answer there. I think there's a time and a place to be obedient, but um, um, I'd say that I am... You know, getting, um, getting respect by putting yourself out there and being a the quiet person who do the most. Once you earn your respect, you can, you know, you can step up and people actually listen to you. What happens when the federal government increases the income tax? Um, it's not necessarily... All around the country where the taxes are lower relatively, but um, the what's in mobile is labor. And that's why we have labor in unions. So if we can... What do you think about the shutdown the meltdown? It looked like it was okay and everything was alright. But as rates went up, these people really got hammered hard. And I think through a combination of that, when rates started going up, everybody started defaulting at the same time. So that's so much in it, and I feel like it, their business strategy is just a little different. It's not so much for the revenues, but just areas where it's more maybe not necessarily safer, but where they don't have to go. They're they're reducing their their risk. Yeah. Yeah, people just got too greedy. I think it's a risky investment. They never thought about how well it would default. They only thought about how well, how much return they would get because of uh, the housing boom. And so I think uh, it was uh, a result of those fat cats on Wall Street uh, giving out loans and all that shit to uh, poor people who couldn't afford the adjusted rates and so they couldn't pay for stuff when things came down and then they were basically uh, reevaluation of what should have been done. Don't give money to poor people and don't expect them to pay. That's why they default.